Are you ready to live your water dream of going boating and jet skiing, living in a community that redefines luxury and outdoor living, that has easy access to the Waccamaw River? Well, today I have that for you. I'm Gavin Bursa from Innovate Real Estate, and today we're gonna be taking a look at a community known as Pottery Landing right here in Conway, South Carolina. The teeny bit about the location about where Pottery Landing is, you're just minutes away from downtown Conway, so you can enjoy a nice bite to eat or visit some of the local shops nearby and take a nice stroll on the river walk. But the great thing is you're a short drive to everything the Grand Strand has to offer as well. So the location is not bad at all. But a teeny bit about the Pottery Landing community is that they have some great aman amenities, such as it being a gated community with an outdoor community pool. And the best part, you have your own private boat ramp and day docking. So if you're someone that enjoys to go on the Waccamaw River, this is gonna be a great community for you. And the nice thing about Pottery Landing too, they have half an acre lots and homes have to be at least 2,400 square feet as well. So that is great. But now it's time to take a, take a look at luxury and Southern charm at this current listing at Pottery Landing, which is listed by my fellow agent, Rhett from Innovate Real Estate. This home is at 228 Wahi Place. This is a great home with a five bedrooms, five and a half bathrooms. It has over 3,400 heated square feet. And let me tell you, this home is quite amazing with an outdoor oasis, with its own built-in barbecue kitchen and has its own custom heated salt water pool and hot tub. It has a great fenced in backyard, and which is also on a half an acre. But the best part of all, it has your own private covered dock, which is perfect for a pontoon boat, a boat and some jet skis. So you cannot go wrong with that. But Rhett will be giving a walkthrough with us today. So I'm quite excited for that. But before I give it to Rhett, if you guys have any questions about this listing and would like to schedule a show in, feel free to click the description below. You can give me a call, text, or email, and I'll be happy to help. But let me give it to Rhett, Rhett as he's gonna be doing the walkthrough today. Hello folks, I'm Rhett Hazelman with Innovate Real Estate. Uh, as Gavin said, this is a, this property really takes outdoor living and luxury to the next level. Uh, we have an oversized lot here, uh, oversized driveway. As you can see, we can fit a camper and you still have plenty more room for parking. Uh, let's go inside and see what we have to offer. All right, we're gonna start here on the second floor. Uh, as you can see, you have a great sitting area out here. Um, beautiful view out front of the house. And uh, you can wait on your company or guests that are coming over here in these nice rockers. Let's go ahead and check out the second floor. On the second level of the house, you walk right into the kitchen. Uh, middle island here with the stove in the middle. Uh, refrigerator. Microwave, oven, sink, plenty of counter space, plenty of cabinet space as you can see. Then we're gonna go right into the dining, dining area and living area here. Uh, fireplace, TV, couch area, um, plenty of uh, space right here to uh, misconfigure any kind of furniture you want to have in the area. Let's walk right in here to the master suite. Master suite with tray ceilings, uh, king size bed, uh, wood floors, and the master suite also has uh, access to the backyard's porch here. And then you walk right into the master bath, stand up shower, uh, double sinks, tub, and then toilet facility, and plenty of closet space as you can see. All right, we're gonna walk right outside from the master bathroom, bedroom, to another porch on the second level. This porch is gonna bring you right out to your backyard oasis. Great, great view of the pool, hot tub, and you can see right down the dock to the river. Upstairs is a nice lounge swing. 
and even a second uh, barbecue they have up here could be an option. And as, as you walk right back in to the living room, it's the second interest level from the second level. All right, follow me upstairs and we'll check out the other bedrooms. Okay, so we're up here on the third floor now. I'd like to point out uh, the utility room. We have a nice washroom, nice size washroom in here. Uh, plenty of table space right here to fold clothes or whatnot. The best thing is the three bedrooms up here. You don't have to bring laundry all the way up the stairs or up the elevator. This is gonna go right to one of the bedrooms. Uh, nice size bedroom, uh, its own bathroom. All three bedrooms do have their own bathroom up on this level. Nice size closet here. And then uh, we're gonna walk over to the second bedroom on this level. This bedroom also has, like I said, its own bathroom. Uh, stand up shower, tub, uh, sink, toilet right here. And then this bedroom has a nice walk-in closet, plenty of space. As you can see for any kind of storage you might need. The third bedroom is right out here to the right. Third bedroom, there's a walkthrough with double closets right to the third bathroom. And again, a stand up shower and tub, wooden sink and toilet. And then out here in the loft, there's a linen closet and an attic for extra storage. This is the one cool part about the house is we do have an elevator. It is three levels. So we're going to take the elevator and meet you on the third and on the bottom floor. Okay, we're down here on the bottom floor of this home. This uh, room right here, uh, could, it's a flex area. It can be used as a playroom, another bedroom. Uh, there's a closet here, and then this door right here leads out to the garage area. We're going to go back in here. This is a, a second living space. This area right here can really be used for anything. The sky's the limit. Uh, office area, second living room. Uh, the, is, this could be used as a bedroom or an ensuite as well. There's a bathroom here, uh, full bath, full shower, full uh, bathroom. Uh, this room right here is currently being used as a uh, gym, a home gym. Again, uh, it's very, very flexible space. It can be used as a home office, playroom, uh, even another bedroom. Uh, we have access to outside right here and through this room here. So let's go outside this way and we'll check out the uh, outdoor kitchen. Okay, so we made it outside. Uh, this is really where this property shines. Uh, if you're an outdoorsy person and enjoys relaxing, spending time outside, this is really where you want to be. Right here, we got a full kitchen counter. We have a sink, a uh, barbecue, uh, island, uh, smoke or island here. There's another water hookup out here if you want to add an ice machine or, or another refrigerator. There is a small refrigerator already here for the counter space. And then for entertaining guests, you have this beautiful table over here. That as you can see, seats about 12. And then we're still covered space right here. You're gonna have some sitting area uh, to enjoy, you know, even if the uh, the weather's a little rainy or anything, you can still enjoy the outdoor area, the view of the pool, the view of the hot tub. Plenty of uh, stone patio space right here for furniture around the pool. And then you can also enjoy the fire out here this big custom stone fire pit. We're gonna walk down to the dock now to take a look at the Waccamaw River. And out here is really where South Carolina shines the most, is nature. Whether your pastime is kayaking, uh, catching a bass off the dock out here, or just sitting around and watching the boats go by, 
there's really no limit to any of the activities out here to just enjoy nature. So we're gonna go, this is a, a day dock here for your friends to pull up. Uh, they can you know, dock up here and have, have a day. Uh, we have one lift here that can be a, used for jet ski, a john boat up to 11 feet, or any kind of kayak that you might have. And this is the covered area. Covered sitting area, uh, a couple uh, hammocks out here for leisure. Uh, we have a fish cleaning station with running water out here. Uh, plenty of lighting and electricity as well. Uh, ceiling fan. For the brave ones out there, there's a top deck jump. You can uh, have about a 15 foot jump there sometimes. Pontoon lift can be converted for two jet skis. And then we have a deep hole lift here too. Uh, up to a 28 foot boat has been parked here. And what else is there really to say about the beautiful Waccamaw River? I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of taking a look at this community known as Pottery Landing right here in Conway, South Carolina. This is a great community, especially if you're someone that wants to be on the intercoastal waterway and take advantage of some boating and jet skiing. And of course, this, this current list in here is a real treat. So if you guys have any questions about Pottery Landing or about this current list in here, or just want, or have questions about moving to the Grand and strand area or you're just thinking about some other intercoastal waterway communities feel free to reach out all my information is in the description below so give me a call text or email and i will be happy to help but if you guys did enjoy today's video give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel to stay up to date on everything going on in the grand strand area but i hope you guys keep on enjoying that myrtle beach lifestyle and i'll see you guys next time thanks